We ask that you join us in promoting character and sportsmanship in high school athletics. We encourage athletes and coaches to be positive role models and ask that you help us by respecting the efforts of the teams and officials in today's game. Give high fives for sportsmanship and celebrate the teams on the field. The officials for today's game are enrolled by the MIAA. Their experience and integrity qualify them to administer the rules of the game. Now let's meet the lineups. First, for the Brockton Boxers, number one, Jayla Smith. Number two, Olivia Shaw. Number three, Lena Marion. Number four, Jaylena Davis. Number five, Alexis Ciambrello. Number six, Jada Fernandez. Number seven, Jala Curran Stewart. Number eight, Madison Moore. Number nine, Maya Otera. Number 10, Kayla Murphy. Number 11, Danielle Davids. Number 12, Megan Ortendahl. Number 13, Vanessa Dos Anjos. Number 14, Deanna Desronville. Number 15, Stefania Dos Santos. Number 17, Olivia Montiel. Number 18, Melanie Tavares Xavier. Number 20, Ciaran Olmstead. Number 22, Madison Hendrigan. Number 23, Lara Cardoso. Number 24, Alicia Toman. And goalkeeper, Alish Olmstead. The Brockton Boxers are coached by Timothy Kaprinsky. And now for the Newton South Lions. Number one, Olivia Dubin. Number two, Lucy Jakes. Number three, Willa Francis. Number four, Macy Abiati. Number five, Bella Ertel. Number six, Maya Madison. Number seven, Daphne Francis. Number eight, Cassie Lee. Number nine, Lottie McLeod. Number 10, Audrey Levy. Number 11, Angela Perry. Number 12, Grace Penna. Number 13, Sarah Lavelle. Number 14, India Blythe. Number 15, Jenny Utstein. Number 16, Kat Fortes. Number 17, Laura Agarkov. Number 18, Danny LaCamera. Number 19, Taylor Patterson. Number 20, Tess Ertel. Number 21, Adrian Goodfriend. Number 22, Rosie McLeod. 
number 23, Larissa Williams. Number 24, Alexandra Dokianis. Number 25, Amanda Lee. And number 28, Naomi Lifman. Newton South is coached by Doug McCarthy, assisted by Owen Pennant Jones and Emma Friedman. At this time, we ask that you rise for the playing of our national anthem. If they'll give me a countdown afterwards. Good afternoon, soccer fans of all ages. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here at Newton South in Massachusetts for the playoff match between the Newton South Lady Lions and the Brockton Lady Boxers. This one, well, in terms of record and on paper, Newton South should win this game, but expect nothing but the best effort from the Brockton Lady Boxers. It is a playoff game, and this is why we play all the games. But the Lady Boxers are looking for a miracle against this one. As the Newton South Lady Lions are 14-1-2. And, and the Lady Boxers are 4-13-1. and, 13 and 1. The senior, the senior striker for the Lady Boxers, Mia Otero, number nine. They need to go to her early, and she's 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 the heart of the team, and she needs to score her goals for this one. I just see a lot of enthusiasm by the players. A lot of enthusiasm. They're ready for this one. Winner goes on, loser goes home. May the best team win.
and we are underway for this playoff matchup. The weather has been bipolar here at Newton. Rain, sunshine, windy. It's been it's 58 degrees currently right now. And this should be a good one. Now here's here's Newton South early on that turn. It's a nice save. My senior in Olmstead. The starting goalkeeper. Early attack by Newton South. They've been doing that all year. The Lady Boxers defense is going to be a key to this one. A, a big key. Here's the corner. with two early offensive possessions. Uh, and here's another corner coming up for them. That one's cleared away. A goal kick is coming up. Newton South having a, a year of the lifetime. They scored 66 goals. To only nine allowed on the year. An incredible season for them. It'll be a stunner if they go home and lose to an inferior lady boxer team. There's Alicia Talkman for the lady boxers trying to get going. Nice dribbling by the Newton South Ball Club. Alicia Talkman battled it out. A bit. Here's the pass oh, down the left sideline. Nice defense by Danielle Davids, the captain defender. She's going to be very active in this one tonight and today. Now here's the throw by number 23 of the Newton South Lions, Larissa Williams. And here's a kick way over the goalpost. The Lady Boxers have yet to bend on the Newton South territory. And nature is having a feel on this one as it's very cold and windy. Headed. There's Mia Otero, out of play. Nice save by the Newton South Lions, down the right sideline. See here in Olmstead with the hold. And she'll kick it away. Alicia Talkman. Corralled by the Newton South goalkeeper. A fair showing in the audience tonight. A lot watching this one. 
Another free kick coming up as the wind moved the ball. Free kick. Guys doing south. Ooh, a little trip. And held in by Senior and Olmstead. A pretty nice save. Lena Marion. And to the left of the goal. A little a little action going in by the lady boxers. That's, a, that's exactly what they needed. Coach Kapritsky will be a little hot will be a pretty little proud about that. A little throw in for the lady boxes. Alicia Talkman uses her body a bit. That one's going the other way. Larissa Williams down the left sideline for the Lady Lions. Here's the cross held in by Olmstead. A pretty easy one for Olmstead. Yeah, that one's all sides. The pass by the Lions. And number two, Lucy Jinx is just dribbling. Larissa Williams, the forward. Yeah, that one gets away from him. The Lions are ranked 277th in the nation. And that record was certainly that ranking would certainly jump up a bit if they could get a win today in this playoff. Ooh, a bit of a push. Mio Taro kind of gotten, gotten a licking.
Here's the kick. That one will get to Danielle Davids. Oh, little stolen. Ooh. And we have a substitution on the way for the lady boxes. By Sierra Olmstead. Good defense by the lady boxes as well. As we have a corner on the way. That one will get away. Offsides. Passed the defense a bit too far. The Lions are wishing they can get that one back. Could have been their first goal with about 26 minutes to play in the first half. Nice passing by the Lions. Intended for Mia Otero, but that'll get to the New South goalkeeper. Here's New South. Nice defense by the boxers. Doing south on the attack again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
And here's, and here's, here's, it's no good, no good. She was wide left. Newton South with many chances in this one. And if, the more chances they get, the soon they'll capitalize. Still a zero zero game. And the wind is just picking up in this one. The the girls are certainly feeling it today. Is the lady boxes hit by Danielle Davids? That one's defended. And there's the pass. Has it himself, and and it's a goal for Newton South. It was a good, it was a nice pass by Larissa Williams. And and I believe that was Audrey Layton, the forward senior, with the goal. She was all alone. Nice execution by Newton Self. Now this is a one nil game. Number 10, Audrey Levy with one goal today. Mia Otero. That was a nice boot, but not good enough. The lady boxes are just looking to capitalize. New South, the smaller team in terms of height and weight, but a lot of heart in them. As, as they control most of the possession so far today. Boxes are looking for something. Mia Otero has been under harass for most of the game. Double teamed. Nice kick by Kayla Murphy. And that one's no good. Here comes Newton South with another one. Ooh. That'll be a foul. The Newton South crowd shaking their bells and sort of enjoying this 1-0 lead so far.
Maya Madison for the Lady Lions is looking to check this one. Lucy Jenks for the Lions in a battle with Danielle Davids. Lucy Jenks wins the battle. And here's the Lions. Closed in by the Lady Boxers. And now we'll go the Lions way. The midfield, the Brockton midfielders are just doing all that they can to keep up with the speed of the lines. Nice pass. Nice move. Easily cleared up by the lines. Here's a pass to the left side. And a call on the field against Brockton. It's a one nil game with 16 minutes to play. Lady Boxers won the Big Three division, beating out Durfee and New Bedford, but not having their luck right now against the New and South Lions. As the Lions were seven and one in their division.
No card is given to Jaylena Davis. The emotions got gone to Jaylena Davis a bit. But another chance for the Newton South. This one is headed a bit. A nice move by the Newton striker. It'll be a throw in for Newton South. And this has been, we've seen some physical play here today. And this is playoff soccer, that's what it's all about. There's another throw in. Mia Otero looking for something. The Newton South defense is doing a great job. Some substitutions for the boxes. This woman is just so strong. That one's going Brockham's way. The winds are the winds are at about twenty five to thirty five miles per an hour in this one. Now here's another chance for New South. Oh, Jayla Courage store falls. And ooh, and, and, and New and South nearly capitalized on their second goal. That one's behind the goalposts. The Lady Boxers just has to get their offense going. Lucy Jenks, keeping her dribble alive. She goes for the kick and it's no good. Held in by Olmstead. Olmstead doing a pretty good job in this one. Only allowing one goal with many attacks by the Lions. Little 
player is falling. Here are the Lions again. And it's a goal. It looks like it was all too lazy with their second goal of the game. An early 2-0 lead. Early 2 0 lead for the Lions. Brought the Lady Boxes haven't had an answer for the her in this one. Time out on the field. We are back after that timeout intermission. 2 0 lead for the Lions. Two goals by Audrey Levy. The Lions are just more of the talented team in this one so far. Alicia Talkman, the boxer midfielder, she's been she's been corralled a bit in this one. And here she is again. 
the Lions defense just surrounding every time a boxer or player gets the ball in their feet. And their defense is doing an outstanding job. Another throw in for the Lions. Talkman, here she goes a bit. And Mia Otero been quiet in this one. Kayla Murphy, back to Davids. Davids passes blocked. Jayla Corinne Stewart. Once he gets the ball in your hands, then that one will be held in by Olmstead. About about 6:40 to play in the first half. Will this call go? A yellow card has been assigned to Jayla Corinne Stewart. That's her first warning, her second, her second card, and she is out of the game. The lady box is trying to plead to the referee. The referee here today is having his is having his hands full a bit. A lot of a lot of physical calls so far in this one. There's a throw by Murphy. The lady boxers need to get something going after that timeout. Substitution for the Newton South Lines. Levy again, and here's Levy, oh. and that one gets by. Beautiful save by Olmstead, I believe. 
Olmstead has been active in this one. There's another possession by the Lions. Down the right side. Larissa Williams kicking off the post and Sierra Holmes that will have another hole to it. Mia Otero just to the right side to Talkman. Here's Talkman jimbling a bit. Here's Brockton Chance. A pass. The Newton goalkeeper will take care of that one. get there fast enough. About two minutes to play in the first half. Newton North with a 2-0 lead. off again, Larissa Williams. Blocked by Brockton. And Brockton has has start, has been starting to get their touches a little late in the second half, in the first half. Nice move by that was actually Cat Forts. That is the end of the first half. The Newton South Lady Lions have been looking strong in this one. 2-0 over Brock. Two, goal, two goals by Audrey Levy. And we will be back after these messages. And we are back here in Newton. Newton South with a 2-0 lead. Newton Software was active and early. They've been active most of the entire game with, with nice offensive possessions in this one. And here's Newton South again. That one got in the way from her. Audrey Levy with two goals in this one. And this one has been a windy one. It's been windy the, throughout most of the game. Audrey Levy with nice dribbling. Smart play by Olivia Mathelia. Is a throw in for Newton South.
Audrey Levy with the cross. That one's over the goal. And Levy, the f senior forward for the Newton South Lions, little. She's been she's been all over this one right now, ha having the possession on her toes a lot. Brockton needs something. Has a lot, a lot pass. Nice control of the ball by Levy. And cross. Nice save. Wow, what a save by Olmstead. Wow. Beautiful save. But the Lady Boxer stars have been silent in this one, such as Lena Marion, Mia Otero. Kayla Murphy has, 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 hasn't been showing up a bit. Vanessa Dan Dos Enjos hasn't been showing up. Madison Moore has been silent. The Brockton stars need to really get their act together a bit. And here's Olmstead with another say, oh! And a little controversy on the field. We don't know what just occurred. And it's a call against Newton Self. A Newton South corner is upcoming. Here's the kick. That one's no good. A Brockton Lady Boxer goal kick. Brockton. A lot of defense by the Lady Boxers. Nice defense. And here comes Brockton. The pass was no good. Haven't even quite seen Jayla Smith on the field for the Lady Boxers, and this one's this one's a little 
A little, and the lady boxer are just looking a bit perplexed. This one's no good, it's out of play. Larissa Williams with the cross. And that one will go the other way due to a call. Here comes Brockton. Just nice defense by the Lions. They've been they've been stopping that Brockton attack all day. Brockton has barely gotten a sniff of the 20-yard line in this game. Jayla Corinne Stort will let that one go by. As there's a call on the field. Sides. Newton South looking for a third goal with about 31 minutes to play in the game. Madison Moore was looking like a, a leg brace on her leg. Audrey Levy. And this one, Madison Moore. And this one's held in by Olmstead. Olmstead, a pretty good game in this one, allowing only two goals. But an even better game by the Newton South goalkeeper. Here's a move by Madison Moore. Madison Moore. Dribbles, a good pass to Lena Marion. That was another clear out by the Newton South defense. The Newton South defense has been pretty much like a wall today. Flar Cardoso with the throw in. Pass. Here comes Newton South. Olmstead, one on one with the goalkeeper. It's a miss. <laughs> Newton South, no shine, no signs of slowing up. They're, they're continuing to attack.
Newton South just playing what their record says it is in this one. And substitutions are upheld on the field right now. Madison Moore looking for something. with the ball on the feet a bit. Here's an attack by Newton South is no good. Four minutes to play in this one. There's a corner for the Lions. Andrea Levy. And this one is missed. Another missed goal. And the Lions with there had some missed opportunities. They're looking at that scoreboard and looking and this and, and wondering that the, the two nil lead should be a lot larger than what it is. And the wind is just picking up in this one. It has not been the wind gusts have not stopped at least once in this game. Brockton just can't get anything going. I see more orange shirts than white shirts in this one, and it's kind of crazy. Here's, here's Brockton. Olmstead will hold on to it. A nice save by Olmstead. She's doing that. She's doing everything she can to make this game competitive. Because the Brockton offense just can't get anything going against this South Newton South defense. Thank you. 
south corner. And it's a goal for the North South Lions. That was Larissa Williams. She has an assist, and now she has a goal from this one. Three nil lead for the Newton South Lions. Mia Otero looking for something quickly. quickly. There's New South again. The pass. It's another goal. And this one's offside actually. Mm. Offside's call. Substitutions. The New England South Lions just are just looking like the better team in this one. 20 minutes away from a playoff victory. Loser goes home, winner goes on. This playoff game has been controlled by the Lions. Story will tackle that one out of play. Lady Boxer just trying to look for something. Yeah. 
Another opportunity for the Lions. The New and South Lions keeping their attack going. And Brockton just trying to get something going. You got to you got to open that. And here's Mia Otero, easily blocked. Another pass, it's no good. Another throw in by the Lions. The Lions are just, the Lions, they've just been full throttle in this one. No, no slowing down. There's about 15 minutes to play in this playoff matchup. Brockton's going to need a miracle in this one to catch up in this one. Mia Otero. Stolen. see the will of the Brockton player just looking a little defeated. Just, just looking for signs of hope. Not, not much, not much dribble, not much dribble power coming up in this one. Madison Moore, not able to get it. A throw in. Kayla Murphy will just kick this one away and intended for Lena Marion. No, excuse me, that was Madison Moore. Okay. 
Is Newton South in block in cleared away. Twelve minutes to play in this one. Three no lead for the Lions. And a little The Lion players are just a bit more talented and a little bit more skilled than, than the Lady Boxing and and more speed as well. This playoff matchup is soon to wrap up as the Lions are looking to advance in this one. Eleven minutes to play. Brockton needs Brockton needs to just get that ball to the Newton South territory, but this defense has been doing a good job. And here comes Newton South with another opportunity. The ball slipped away from her. Audrey Levy with the kick, blocked by Curran Stort. That one's away. A goal kick coming up for Brockton. It's stolen because Brockton with another attack. Nice in. That one, that one went away from them. A player falls. A foul is committed. That one will get away from the Newton striker. This one's about about wrapping up. Three in the lead from for the Newton South Lions and not much not much going for the Brockton Lady Boxes. And this one's a kick. This one's no good. Wide right. A nice move. She's a foul was called. A free kick coming up for the Lions.
The box is doing everything they can, and this one's headed. And Sierra Olmstead has been probably the best player for the Lady Boxes, and she allowed three goals. No one else has even showed up. Another attack by the New and South Lions. And this one's a scuffle in the goal. And it's a goal for the New and South Lions, their fourth of the game. They're about ready to ride into the playoffs. They're about in this one, and Brockton's looking a little, looking like they're in the wheels, beating them up, and as the timeout is on the field, we'll be back right after these messages. We are back. Noon South goalkeeper. She's been sleeping in this one. And this Newton South team, they look like they could be any team in the tournament looking with their performance today. And here's Brockton with something, and that's no good. There's <laughs> <laughs> a kick to midfield. Danielle Davis in a battle, and she bumps. She bumped Tess Erto of Newton South. No calls ca called. About 4.50 to play in this one. 4 0 lead. And the Lady Boxers' season is on the ropes. This one's a kick. How did that Olmstead?
a Newton South Thurwin. The Newton South team, the way they've been dribbling the ball, just so, just very aesthetic and elegant and just fluid. Just nice dribblers for all the players on this squad. As they look to advance in this playoff matchup. And a little foul on the field. A Newton South free kick. About two, about two and a half minutes to play here. Just nice passing by the Lions. And another opportunity for the Lions. Late substitutions in this one for Newton South. Brockton, as I said earlier, has it uh, another another player fall, another another player falls, and Brockton, as I said earlier, hasn't even gone to the twenty to the Newton South twenty yard line territory. Not much today. As, as some of the upperclassmen for the Lady Boxers will will say goodbye to their Lady Boxer careers for soccer. As this may be, as for some of them, could be their last games of soccer. And another attack by the Lady Lions. And it's uh, held in by Olmstead. She's probably been the most accurate today for this boxer team. Alicia Talkman. A boxer throwing to Talkman, and she loses control of the ball. South Lions advance in the playoffs. Their opponent is to be determined. As, a, as it's a farewell season for the Lady Boxers. They finished the year 4-14. Four and 14. And it was, a, it was a great season overall for the Newton South Lions. Losing only one game on the season. But it's a wrap. Four goals in the four goals in this one. Two goals by Audrea Levy. She was she was consistent in this game, and but that is a wrap. Four to zero here in Newton.